I just discovered an online app that is making $26,000 per month. And the person that built it has no coding experience and used an AI app builder to create it. Today, I'm going to reveal what this app is that's making $26,000 per month and how he built it even though he's not a programmer. However, as I did my research, I got so fascinated with this idea of AI assisted programming that I decided to build my own tool. I'm going to build this tool right in front of you, and I truly have no coding experience. The tools are available to make your ideas into reality. In this video, I'm going to give you the inspiration, examples, and the tools that you need to get started. So, what web app built by a non-programmer using AI coding tools could possibly be making $26,000 per month? Let me introduce you to FormulaBot.com. FormulaBot was created by David Bressler because he was constantly being asked by his coworkers how to do different tasks and formulas in Microsoft Excel. David is an expert in Excel, but he's not a programmer. He figured that if he could build an add-on tool to Excel that was as easy to talk to as a chatbot and would help you create complex formulas and do data analysis for you on your spreadsheets, then he might not be hounded so much for questions at work. He also had a hunch that others might be willing to pay for it. So David worked his full-time job, and then in the evenings, he'd go to work trying to build FormulaBot. Since David is not a programmer, he ended up using Bubble.io, which is an AI-powered, no-code platform. Now, David could simply use Bubble to explain what he was trying to do in Excel and what he was trying to build, and Bubble would help him turn that idea into reality. Obviously, he needed to do lots of tweaking and lots of prompting to get his app right, but he was able to build an MVP with no coding experience. If you're enjoying today's video, can I ask a quick favor? Will you please hit the subscribe button for me? You see, I have a goal to hit 100,000 subscribers on YouTube, and I'm getting really close. If you could take a split second and click the subscribe button, I would be very grateful. Thank you so much. So, what exactly does FormulaBot do today? Well, it's a chatbot that lives directly in your Excel spreadsheet. If you aren't sure how to create a formula, you just type and ask FormulaBot for help. FormulaBot will then create the formula for you and make your spreadsheet work how you want it to. In addition, FormulaBot will do data analysis on your spreadsheet and provide insights into trends, data, and more. And the pricing plans range anywhere from zero to $35 per month. In a recent interview, David revealed that his business is now making around $26,000 per month. His story is such an inspiration for what is possible when you have a good idea and execute on that idea even if you don't have any programming experience. Now, the reality is that you can't build a tool and expect it to start making over $20,000 per month without doing any marketing. David put in a ton of effort into marketing to make his app a success. Later in this video, I'm going to share what marketing David did to make his app a success. But first, I'm going to build my own app using a no-code tool right in front of you. You see, I've heard tons of stories of how easy it is to build a fully working app using AI, but I've never really built anything like that using these tools. So I want to experiment with how easy or difficult it really is. There are tools like bubble.io, lovable.dev, cursor.ai, or even just ChatGPT that can help. However, I'm going to use a new tool called Hostinger Horizons. Hostinger is the sponsor of today's video, and so I thought I'd dive in and see how quickly I could build a fully functioning web app. So, what idea should I build? Well, I want to build something that is relevant to my Niche Pursuits audience, and one of the number one problems that followers of Niche Pursuits have is that they are looking for side hustle ideas, online business ideas, and in general, trying to find their niche pursuit. So what if I built a simple web app that helped users brainstorm unique online business ideas that match their passions and interests? So here's my vision. I envision a landing page that people come to that has a simple question of, what are you passionate about? And a simple text box that allows them to enter a subject. The web app will then spit out a list of ideas based on their passions or interests. So let's see what we can build using hosting or horizons. Now, I truly have never used this tool before, and I'm creating this video live without testing anything first. 
I'm just typing in the first prompt that comes to my mind and I'm going to show you the edits I make and the final product. Here's my prompt. I want to build a simple one-page web app that helps people brainstorm unique side hustle ideas. Here's what I envision. One, the big headline at the top says, what are you passionate about? Two, just below the headline is a text box where the user is expected to input a word or phrase related to what they are passionate about. Three, the web app then displays 10 side hustle ideas, including several online side hustle ideas related to that passion. Four, below the 10 results is a button that says show 10 more. Each time the user clicks this button, 10 more side hustle ideas related to the subject they entered initially. Make sure there are no duplicate ideas. Five, make the design and feel of the web app more high tech. Go ahead and build the tool. Check this out. It's building the tool right in front of me. Wow. Are you kidding me? That's like exactly what I kind of envisioned. And it <laughs> cool. It's like done. This is nuts. To say that I'm blown away at how well it took my ideas and implemented them would be an understatement. The design and the implementation with the search bar and list of ideas is exactly what I was looking for. However, when I told the web app that I was passionate about honeycombs, it suggested generic and a little unrealistic things like start a honeycomb cereal subscription box service, create honeycomb cereal related merchandise, start a honeycombs Serial membership site. Great. Honeycomb Serial NFT. Start Honeycomb Serial Podcast. I don't know if these are really good, but it's funny. Honeycomb Serial right. ebook. Oh. <laughs> so let's chat and try to fix that. I can see that there's lots of ideas that are somewhat generic. For example, when I input pickleball, one idea is to create a pickleball YouTube channel. Or when I input bananas, one idea is the exact same to create a banana YouTube channel. Can you try to make the ideas more specific to the subject or be more unique? In addition, be sure to include a few offline ideas as well, ideas that aren't run on the internet. The results should be a mix. With this resulting tweak, I can see that this has indeed improved some of the suggestions a bit as it's starting to include a broader variety of ideas. When I input CrossFit, it actually comes up with a few good ideas like develop a CrossFit team building program for corporations. But let's add a few more details. Here's what I asked. I would like the ability to click on each of the results and have it expand into more details. When someone clicks on the idea, it should expand and explain briefly one, what the idea is, two, a few steps required to start and market the idea, and three, what the realistic potential revenue is of the business. As you can see, it took these suggestions in stride and immediately made the results expandable and included more details on each of the business ideas. Pretty cool how quickly it is taking my suggestions and implementing them. I then went back and forth with the web app builder as I tweaked the headlines, added an idea counter, and a few other minor tweaks. I actually really like the idea of an idea counter, but it would have required me to sync up a database to make it work properly. And honestly, getting the database may have only taken me 30 minutes, so it's very possible that when you go and try my app after watching this video, the idea counter may be working. However, as of the recording of this video, here's what it looks like. You can go to nichepursuits.com slash ideas to check it out. All right, let's try a couple of ideas. First, let's try cooking. And as you can see, it immediately spits out. Create custom dining travel experiences. Kind of cool. Create a community event series around kitchen. Develop personalized kitchen coaching programs. Develop personalized dining coaching programs. Create custom kitchen travel experiences. All right, some of these are mixed. Let's go ahead and input another one. Let's try pickleball. All right, create a premium pickleball marketplace for enthusiasts. I create a community event series around pickleball. That's actually pretty cool. And if you um, click on any of these, it will expand, give you a description. It'll give you steps to start the idea. It'll even give you some marketing ideas, like create an introductory offer for first time clients build partnerships with complementary businesses, etc., and it gives some revenue potential, right? Launch a premium pickleball product line. So it does give you some unique ideas, and uh, sometimes you can see that uh, it does give me the show 10 more, and other times it does not. So I might have to tweak that. But um, overall, pretty cool how quickly I was able to build this app. Now, of course, 
This does still need some work. I can make some tweaks. And if I really wanted to make this idea even better, uh, I can hook this up to OpenAI, and I think this would be really, really solid with the ideas. And hooking up OpenAI API key and using Hosting or Horizons would probably only take me less than an hour to set up. In total, I've spent about 45 minutes from start to finish building what you see right now. My mind is seriously blown with how easy it is to get a web app up and running using AI and no code tools nowadays. If you want to check out Hostinger Horizons to build your own web application, just go to hostinger.com slash niche horizons. You can get started for free with five chat messages. Or when you sign up for Hostinger Horizons, you can select a plan ranging anywhere from 50 messages to 500 messages per month. I built my web app with Hostinger Horizons using less than 20 chats. When you go to checkout on Hosting or Horizons, be sure to use coupon code NICHE at checkout in order to get an extra 10% off. Again, just go to hostinger.com slash niche horizons in order to get started today. Thanks again to Hosting or Horizons for sponsoring today's video. Now, let's talk about marketing. As David showed with Formula Bot at the beginning of this video and how I just demonstrated with my Quick Business Ideas app, you can quickly build a web app with no code tools. However, in order to get customers, you need to do some basic marketing. What did David do to go from zero to $26,000 per month? First, he told all of his coworkers and the people he knew personally that might benefit from using Excel easier. They loved his product and started using it. Then he found the Excel community on Reddit and shared what he built. Within a week, his post blew up and tons of people shared his idea. So you need to go where your community congregates and tell as many people as possible. Then he posted in the Internet is Beautiful subreddit and that really put his app on the map. Then he started running Google ads and doing SEO and started getting even more customers. He has continued to hustle and find other ways to talk about his product wherever he can on podcasts, YouTube channels, social media, and more. So just because you can build an app easily that is awesome, you need to actively market it and find your target audience. Want to see how free tools can also make big money? You don't necessarily need to charge money in order to make money from your creations. I recently created a video that dives into how a free tool website is making over $400,000 per month. Go ahead and check out that video right here. Thanks again for watching.